Hey everyone, I'm Ivan Zhravlyov, the CEO of Shadow Design Company. Today, we're going to demonstrate you our way of making square corners with anti-lens for PVC ceilings kit. The construction is slitless by Flexi Company. The outer corner joint is 45 degrees. The inner corner is cut in half and bent with a tri-square. The most of joints are welded. Some of them are with a gap tape. After setting the frame, we take one piece of the tape from anti-lens kit and prepare it. Put the tape on a flat surface, then press it through with a blunt instrument. After this, we we'll take the primer from the same kit and spread it on a cloth. To wipe the square corner with upper and lower lips. It will help to fix the wrinkles when shrinking our PVC ceiling on. Then wait for 15 to 20 seconds up to 2 minutes for dry out. Then take the protection layer off the prepared tape. And begin to stick it down. Starting from the upper lip. and press it through again for maximum effect. After this, cut the rest of the tape. and slowly tear it off. For proper ceiling installation, do it with a partner. And always keep the ceiling warm. Make sure you distribute the material proportionally in regard to the inner corner. Upon that, keep the inner corner a little loose. It'll help to avoid tears and speed up the corner's installation. После того, как мы распределили все важные узлы и периметр полотна, нам необходимо сейчас обработать праймером. Now, take the primer again 
and wipe the sealing material in the spot where we'll stick it down. Notice that the primer is harmless to the material. Then take the other protection layer off the tape and continue the sealing installation. For the first view, the ceiling looks not so clean and smooth. But after you straighten the surface and the corner area, tightening them up and moving the wrinkles from the corner with a gap tape, you'll like your work and get your client satisfied. In some cases, when doing this, you can find a little bump on the upper lip of the corner. I'd recommend you to weight the upper level ceiling installation and only after that get rid of this bump. Make sure you don't overheat the material to avoid tears and further problems. This is how the ordinary position of the square corner looks like. And this is where our anti-lens kit starts to work. To clean your ceiling, you can use the cleaning kit by Starworks company. You can find it in any DIY store. So we've finished the installation. And you can see how the classic square corner looks like. The method is called with a lens. Warm the corner area and begin to press it through bottom to top.
after this, if you have wrinkles, just straighten them with a gap tape. So guys, we've made anti-lens kit review for you. This is an ultimate solution for multi-level PVC ceiling construction installation with no lens. The kit consists of a flask. Inside you have 10 pieces of tape, 10 centimeters long each. That means you can use it for over 10 corner installations, depending on the height of a construction. A primer is the next in the kit. It improves the adhesion of the surfaces, aluminium and PVC in our case. You can use it for much more than 10 corners. So also apply it to stick in the rings, overcover the ceiling material, as well as to install LED strips and many more. We've developed two kits. The first is made for flexi constructions and the other one for pro Z ceiling construction. The only difference between them is in the tape width. The tape has handy holders. The resistance to chemical reactions primer flask volume is 10 milliliters. The installation temperature of the kit is over 20 degrees Celsius. The maximum adhesion of the tape is 72 hours. When sticking the tape down, press it hard to make sure you have an adhesion at the molecular level. But keep in mind the ceiling material durability. We use a regular pellet knife with a flexi-lip covering material for that purpose. Our experience counts over three years of corner installation. So anyways, you can rely on a three-year warranty. 
with the adherence to the specifications. In 72-hour period, the tape is very durable to temperature changes and covers the range of minus 30 up to plus 93 degrees Celsius. When spreading the primer on the cloth, pay attention to the fact that its flask has no button. It was made to close the floss each time you use the primer and not to lose this volatile material qualities. Совсем немножечко не необходимо для того, чтобы начать им работать. Намазали на тряпочку, закрыли, убрали слой из подсумок и намазываете. Праймер наносится тоненьким слоем. The primer has no negative effect on the materials you use it with. С внутренней стороны. При этом потолок не разъедается, не повреждается и не выцветает. And it simply enhances the adhesion qualities of the sealing materials. The idea of such a kit came to us from the past years, when we always tried to find the best solution to get rid of the corners with a lens. We've tested many different kits for that purpose and came to this very kit as an ultimate solution. It covers over 90% of all the square corner installation situations. It's going to give you a competitive position because many people simply refuse to install square corners, having no experience or proper tools to do that. This is why we're making this review and teaching you to install square corners easily. Also, we often have multi-level square corner construction installation workshops, as well as many other topics in Moscow. You can easily get the info contacting us via the phone or any social media. Now I'd like to share with you the best cutting way for the sealing material we've found out over the years of practice. Let's start with the level transition which is 6.5 cm in our case. We leave the point of the corner as it is and also add this 6.5 cm all around the perimeter so that we don't run out the material on edges at the installation time. Then we make a point 25 to 30 centimeters from the corner. And cut the material as the falling. The arc height is a half of the transition width. So let's make it 3 cm in our case.
Then make the same on the other side. Okay, when installing the ceiling, we come across diagon diagonal wrinkles. To get rid of them, you need to drop a perpendicular on a perimeter line on both sides. Then add the same 25 to 30 centimeters to each side. Or I personally like make it a little longer, about 15 centimeters plus. Then draw an arc again. The height of the arc in this case is 8 to 10 percent of the construction width. So if here we have 40 centimeters, the arc height will be 4 centimeters accordingly. That's enough to straighten the corner wrinkles. Repeat the cutting on the other side as well. Shift all the cuts and arcs aside if the geometry of the ceiling is trickier and increase the arc height to compensate tension. I hope you guys liked this video and got something useful out of it. For the last, I wish you all the loyal clients, interesting orders and as many square corners as possible. See you!